Jane Goodall always loved animals. When she was a little girl, she was given a toy chimpanzee named Jubilee, and she took it with her everywhere. She read Tarzan and Dr. Doolittle and dreamed of going to Africa. When she left school, she trained as a secretary and worked as a waitress and for a documentary film company, saving every penny to fulfill her dream. It finally came true in 1957 when Jane went to visit her friend who lived on a farm in Kenya. While she was there, she met a famous paleoanthropologist, Dr. Lewis Seymour Bassett Leakey. He was impressed by Jane's passion and arranged for her to go to the Gombe Stream Game Reserve to study chimpanzees. It wasn't easy. At first the chimps would run when they saw her, but eventually she gained their trust. She observed behaviour that no one else had seen before, like hunting for meat and using and even making tools, something most thought only humans could do. Jane continued her work in the field and got a PhD from Cambridge University. Eventually, her focus shifted from research to conservation. She founded the Jane Goodall Institute, which helps African communities to protect chimpanzees and their environments, and Roots and Shoots, which empowers kids around the world to help the environment. My mission today, the reason I keep going age 90, is because if we lose hope, we do nothing. We don't want to bring children into a world where from the very beginning they believe everything's hopeless. If we get together, if we roll up our sleeves and take action, there is hope for the future of the planet. <laughs>